Hello everyone and welcome back to Music is My Boyfriend, the channel where I, Anais, someone who loves music so much they would marry it, reacts to different music related videos, and I'm going to watch Coldplay and BTS's Inside My Universe documentary. I just watched the music video, saw their performance on Global Citizen Live. YouTube would not let me uh, upload that reaction of the performance. So if you want to see it, I'm going to post it on a Patreon. Thanks to Holly. She suggested that. So the Patreon is going to be set up soon. It'll only be like a dollar to watch the reaction. So I'm not going to make it very expensive. But yeah, let's check out the documentary. I'm excited. to Korea. Okay, uh, cool. I used to come in for two days just to record and it was quite a stressful journey. Well, I guess it's... M I was a little bit nervous. You I've know. never met BTS before. Sorry. I guess it's more affordable to just fly him than fly seven, <laughs> seven band members. But also because of COVID, I think maybe that's why he... It was better probably for him to go than for them to come over here. Aw, did BTS love Coldplay? Are they Coldplay fans? That's so cute. Oh my gosh, he got them gifts. Today has just been like everything I could have dreamed, but a little Music is a weapon. I love that shirt. Yes. Coldplay and BTS. Woo! Oh my gosh, did he get them gifts? That's so cute. Hello. I want to know if he's going to be able to learn all the names. That's what I want to know. <laughs> Especially with the mask, you can't see their face. So I just paused it because I had originally downloaded this video and the downloaded version does not have the subtitles. So I didn't understand what BTS was saying. So now I'm watching it on YouTube with the subtitles. So that's why there's an edit right here. Aww, so cute. Can't believe he's Chris Martin. So adorable. Oh. He was role model and influence. Oh. Oh. oh my god, they're so cute. They're so humble. I love it. They're, they're such fanboys. <laughs> Aww. Aww. He's so admirable. <laughs> you guys are humble too. <laughs> Oh. 
그런 생각 되게 많이 들고 심지어 저는 어쨌든 라이팅까지 하게 됐어요 Man, his voice, oh my gosh Does Chris Martin know Korean? I feel like he knows it. If you speak to Korean, let me know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Perfect. Ah, nice. Recorded with us as well. I really love the theme, not alone but together. Could have been done remotely, but we could add more sincerity to the song this way. Oh, I love it! <laughs> I like uh, BTS's music because, first of all, it's an incredible production and often very unusual structures and different melodies to the ones I hear. You know, like a song like Mic Drop. It's a good one. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Oh my gosh. It's not something we could ever do. So I, I admire it because it's a different skill. Mm. We use dancing instead. I think he likes the idea. A band like us can be so popular globally. I could tell he did a lot of research. He said he looked up videos of us dancing and even added a dance break so we could dance together on stage someday. Aww. See each character, meet each personality, see how everybody's very individual, but they still work as a group. Aww. Get it? Woo! Good. Good song, BTS. Okay. That is a good one. That's a good song, yes. Oh, does he have tattoos like on his hand? Oh, he's worried he's gonna mess up. So cute. Woo. Beautiful voice. Oh my gosh. Oh. We're doing amazing. <laughs> I want to know what the tattoos say on his hands. Different if that's possible. He said this crosses his mind when he wrote the song that when we he wrote the song he was seeing of Coldplay and BTS as representatives of Earth coming together to build a new universe. Aww. Sounds so good. Together. He's trying to say, You're the one who created my universe. This is a very personal song to him, and a part of him is frustrated. 
by the fact that Coldplay can't play live in a concert, I thought about how to make this relevant to BTS since the lyrics go, you are my universe. This song should definitely be dedicated to ARMY. Oh, wrote the lyrics while picturing the day we reunite with ARMY. Oh my god, so sweet. Oh. RM, why are you so sweet? Oh my gosh. So many people. Yes, I agree, Chris. Me, it's nice. It's beautiful. Yes. Then, of course, you don't have to sing English. Okay. You can be famous even if you're not from America. Globally. Yeah, this is nice. Oh, a freaking ad from this is why I don't I hate I don't watch them on YouTube because of freaking ads. Silky, silky smooth. <laughs> Woo! It sounds so good. It sounds great separate, but together as well. Like, mm. well, the song is about how you know the power of love and how it transcends all. Things, oh, that's good. Genders and race and average sexuality. If you look at people right now who are divided by a border or can't be together, oh. that's what the song is about. But how nothing can really stop people loving each other. Oh, it's a good message. <laughs> Hope this song has a positive impact on people. I believe this song could bring great joy to many people. Yeah. Definitely a happy, like, upbeat song for sure. Uh, I listened to Coldplay songs in the shower, a fellow singer facing the same situation, came all the way here. So that gave us a breath of life again. Aww. This genuine look that came from his heart. When we get to have a concert again, it'll be not just touching but overwhelming, whether it's at Coldplay's concert or ours. Yeah, I hope you can sing the song together too, alive. That would be amazing. Yes. Hopefully they'll perform it together on stage. It's like a dream, a dream coming true. Because I saw it in my head for so many months. And now here we are. Woo! <laughs> oh, it's Chris Martin wearing a BTS crew hoodie. Nice. Ooh, yeah, that was great. That was so fun. Um, I just love seeing artists collaborate, and it's so cute that because um, I wondered how this came about, like whose idea was it, and it's really cool that you know BTS was like, we want to work with Chris Martin, and I'm like, oh, that's so cute, like. They're fans and they're all, you know, very humble. You know, they were talking about how Chris Martin is really humble, but they're also very humble. So, you know, humble people recognize other humble people. And if you hear any scratching, it's my dog <laughs> scratching. He likes to do that when I'm recording. And it was good to hear from the guys. I wanted to know what was in the boxes that Chris Martin had at the beginning. Like, was it a gift? Because 
if he got them gifts, that's really cute. And I wanted to know what was in there. So, you know, why did you tease us? You showed us those boxes, but now we don't know what's inside. I want to know. <laughs> if you guys know, somehow let me know in the comments. You know, it was cool to see kind of just like the process, you know, and they're recording different parts and kind of seeing how, you know, they come together to sound so good. You know, they're all very talented on their own. They all have like, you know, different voices and they're great in their own way and then when they come together it's like oh my gosh it sounds so good <laughs> so if you like my shirt i got it at lulus.com that's where i get most of my shirts um so if you want to check it out and get something for yourself at lulus you can check out the link in the video description so you can get a little discount also again i'm going to upload reactions that are blocked by youtube i'm going to upload them on the patreon which i'm going to set up pretty soon hopefully in the next few days so stay tuned for that if you want to check out my social media you can here and i have some other reactions coming up um not just bts but i am gonna do some other bts ones as well and i'm working on a bts special project can't really say much but just if you want to know what it is you gotta subscribe okay it's gonna come it's gonna come it's really excited um <laughs> thank you so much for watching and i will see you guys next time bye